Let's face it, photography is one of those things where you can spend years analyzing every little detail about the images that you see on Instagram just to figure out why your pictures don't look like somebody else's. Or, you know, you could just ask somebody who's already been there and done that, and that's where a mentor comes in. Think about it as the fast pace through the trial and error stages. And hey, since we're on the topic, I'm happy to announce that I am finally going to launch an online mentorship program, but more on that later. First, let's talk about all the benefits that having a photography mentor could potentially have on your photography career and business. What's up? My name is Jay LeBlanc, wedding photographer and photo video educator. I'm happy to announce that after over 10 years in the classroom, teaching hundreds and hundreds of students how to be better photographers and start their own career in photography, I'm finally going to bring all of those resources to everyone here on YouTube, my YouTube family. And I have to note that through my photography career, I've had many mentors, and I would not recommend this to anybody if this wasn't something I've already done myself. I truly believe that having all of these mentors throughout my career has brought me to the level that I am currently at at a much faster pace than if I were to have tried doing this on my own. You could spend hours Googling, looking on YouTube, how to use your flash, how to use different camera settings, how to achieve different effects when it comes to editing. And yes, you will learn it. Those resources are available, but those resources are also generic to the masses. Just like when I make a YouTube video, I'm speaking to a very large audience. It's not that one-on-one -on -one connection. Sure, you can ask questions down in the comments, but it's not that true personal connection that you get from working one-on-one -on -one with a mentor where they are devoting their time to helping you get better. Now let's talk about why you need a mentor. Listen, photography can sometimes be a little bit lonely. We spend a lot of time working behind our computer. We don't get to interact with people on the same day-to-day -day basis as if you were working in an office space. So having somebody that will keep you accountable and motivate you to push yourself to new levels is invaluable for some people. Because let's be honest, sometimes when we're working on our own, we hit plateaus. And sometimes we just need a, a gentle nudge or even a shove to help us get down the right path. Whether it's constructive criticism or a little pep talk or maybe a technological error that happened right at that moment that you're supposed to be shooting. Having somebody in your corner that's there for you can really help you in a time of need. You're also going to get personal feedback. Sure, you could post your pictures in a Reddit thread or a Facebook group, but usually people are just really nice and say, oh, I love it, looks great. I'm gonna be honest with you. When I critique students, I almost always find something wrong with their images because I want to push them to get better. If I tell them everything looks good, well then learning and progress stops. We want to continuously improve what we are doing so we can still level up every single time we go shoot. And probably the most invaluable part of having a mentor is you're going to get real world experience and feedback. This isn't something you're necessarily going to see in a textbook or in a YouTube video. I tell my students all the time to learn from my mistakes. I've been doing this for a long time and I don't want to see you make the same mistakes that I do. That's why I'm gonna steer you in the right direction to avoid the mistakes that I have made, which puts you one step ahead of where I was when I was in your position. So how does a mentor really boost your photography business? One of the most important parts of running a photography business is the business part of it. Unfortunately, it's the sad truth that if you want to run a photography business, you're gonna be spending a lot of time on the business side of it. And a mentor can help you with the not so sexy aspects of being a photographer. And one of my favorite things that I got from my mentors, which I try to pass on to the students that I currently mentor, is the opportunity to network and grow. I've met so many people through my mentors. Just like with the students who I am currently mentoring, I like to try and introduce them to as many different people as possible. This opens so many different doors because you never know who's going to have an opportunity for you one day. And a mentor is really gonna help you with the mindset and confidence that it takes to be a small business owner and be a successful photographer. Almost every photographer has some sort of imposter syndrome where you think, I'm not good enough. Look at these people's pictures online. They're so much better than me, I can't do that. You know what, sometimes you just need a mentor to slap you in the face, say shut up and let's get back to work and stop comparing yourself to somebody else because there's a lot of work out there and if you sit here and cry all day, then that person's gonna to continue to get all the work that you should be getting. And this is why my mentorship 
could help you. I'm going to take the time to make sure you are focusing on the important things and not wasting your time on the little stupid details like the font on your business card or what colors to use on this blog post. Those little details aren't really going to make or break your business, but attending a networking event, reaching out to one more potential client, that could be a potential breakthrough that just skyrockets your business. And that's where we're gonna focus our energy to help you reach your goals as quickly as possible. Because in my eyes, what I wanna see in this world more than anything is good quality photographers. Nothing makes me more upset than seeing people have terrible experiences with low quality photographers because they wanted to save a few dollars. I wish everybody was willing to spend just a little bit more money on that good quality photographer who's going to deliver a fantastic, reliable set of images. And that's what I pride myself on with all the students who I mentor. I want them to be the best photographer they possibly can be because it's a reflection of what I am capable of doing myself. And I don't wanna see any of my students be unsuccessful. Now some common misconceptions about a photography mentorship. People think I can learn everything online. Why do I need a mentor? Sure, the internet is great. But like I mentioned earlier, you can watch a thousand YouTube videos and yes, you will learn something or you can take those thousands of YouTube videos you watched and hundreds and hundreds of hours and invest one or two hours a week into working with a mentor and then you will fast track your success because everything that you are going to be learning is geared specifically to you and your business. It's not generic information for the masses to hopefully get a couple clicks on YouTube. It is information to help you and only you be successful. Some people might also think, hey, a mentorship is just too expensive. I can't afford it. I understand it. Listen, I was a broke college student at one point too. And looking back on it, kind of wish I didn't spend my money on college and I spent it on mentorships because you're learning so much more valuable stuff that is specifically catered to you than you ever would in a college setting. Or maybe you're just not ready yet. Maybe you're thinking to yourself, I need a few more Instagram followers or my website needs to be a little bit better. Or maybe I need to take on a couple more jobs before I have something to show to a mentor. Honestly, if you start doing that, yeah, you're gonna get some experience, but it may not be good experience, and you might have some kind of speed bumps along the way. Starting off with a mentor right from the beginning of your photography journey might be the best choice for you. I'll tell you a quick example of why starting off fresh and totally green might be your best option. It's kind of like when I got my motorcycle license, they told us day one, the best students to learn how to ride a motorcycle are the ones that have no experience because you have no errors to correct to steer you onto the right path. And the same kind of goes for photography. If you don't have the errors and the mistakes in your history that you have to fix before you can start going in the right direction, it just puts you one step ahead. It gets you started on the right path that much quicker. So maybe you're thinking to yourself, you know what, I kind of like what you're saying. It makes sense and I need a mentor. Maybe I'm not the perfect fit. Maybe I am. Let's talk. We'll figure it out together. My personal mentor program is going to offer a one-on-one -on -one style mentorship. It's also going to offer portfolio reviews. I'm going to give personalized business feedback and advice, and I'm going to tailor my advice to your goals. I understand that not everybody is the same. Not everybody wants the same thing out of their photography career. And that's why we will chat about what you want and set those goals and review them on a regular basis, whether we're meeting once a week, every other week, or maybe once a month. The mentorships that I offer are extremely well suited to new photographers, people that are just getting into their photography career. Maybe you have a camera, you have a website, you've done a few jobs here and there, but you have no real direction yet. Or maybe you just picked up a camera and you're like, hey, I wanna start a business with this thing. These are the perfect people who should be reaching out to me talking about this. Or maybe you're somebody who is in the wedding industry and you just need that little extra push to help you get past the plateau that you're currently at. I'm your guy. I will help you out with all of these things. Listen, I have a very strong passion for teaching photography. I actually started teaching photography myself while I was a student getting my degree in photography. I actually liked teaching photography so much that I then went on to get a degree in teaching, which I very quickly realized was 
totally a waste of time. But now I do have that education background in my tool belt. I've been in the classroom setting for over 11 years and doing personal one-on-one -on -one mentoring for over 10 years now. So I come with a lot of experience. This isn't my first time doing this. I've helped hundreds of students in the past, but now I am offering it up to everyone out here on YouTube world. I have worked with people from 18 years old, fresh out of high school, all the way up to people in their 70s who are retired and they're just decided, you know what? Now is the perfect time to start a photography business and everyone in between. So I have experience working with a very wide age range. And while I may specialize in wedding photography, I've actually helped more people start non-wedding businesses than wedding businesses. So I do know a lot about other types of photography other than just weddings. And after years now of teaching photography, I understand that people learn at different paces and they learn different ways. I understand that college might be the right choice for some people. And I understand that it is the worst choice for other people. But in my personal opinion, I tell my college students all the time, college is not necessary for photography. Photography is more about what you can do with a camera than the degree you got from a university. So what I'm trying to do now is take what I teach at a college cut out all the fluff and just give you the important stuff to be a successful photographer. And this is why I am offering to you my personal one-on-one -on -one photography mentorship. I will note that I am only taking on a very select few number of mentorees at first because I still have to run my wedding photography business, my video production business, and I still teach at a college. So I don't have a ton of time, but there's time for some of you. And I am very excited to meet some of you. I'm going to be offering several different types of mentorship packages because I know that different people have different needs. You can check out the link below where you can learn more information about the different offerings that I have. Now, you may not be interested in the one-on-one -on -one mentorship right now. So I'm happy to announce that I'm also going to be starting a Facebook group where we can chat and we can talk a little bit and maybe you can learn a little bit that way as well. And I can hopefully help some more of you out there than I can in the comments of these YouTube videos. Because let me tell you, YouTube does a terrible job with notifications on these videos. Sometimes I see the notification for a comment, sometimes I get nothing. It's only when I click on a video and I go look at the comments that I see these comments. And I'll respond to you sometimes and I get no notification about any replies. So I'm sorry if I have missed your comments in the past, but YouTube does a terrible job of notifications. So if you wanna jump into that Facebook group with us, I will let you know, I'm gonna be doing some pretty interesting things on a weekly and monthly basis that'll help improve your photography. I think it'll be fun to have this community where we could chat, we can learn, we could do some challenges, and we can have fun together and grow our businesses. So please check that out, and I will definitely be able to talk to you a little bit more there than I can here on YouTube. So again, if you're interested in any of this, it's all gonna be linked down below in the description, and I really hope to see some of you there. And until next time, peace.